a little bit of something else tonight. I'm actually curious about the biggest um, potential weight savings on My seat post, sorry, my seat post. And uh, the first thing that I want to do is weigh again because last night off camera, I sanded down the surface and that surface. And then I actually had a better number than what we closed off with in the last video. So the number is now 352. So here we lost two grams, then we lost another gram, and now see what the big cutoff will give us here. So we cut off this part. The first thing that I'm going to do is mask this off nicely. I have basically in the past I've done similar actions a couple of times and if you do not cut it nicely you will have either something that's not looking nice is also not symmetrical so that means it's not quite ideal as for mechanicals and uh, that's why I actually really like to make the effort of drawing this up very nicely so this shall be my highest point then here shall be my lowest point and then cutting from a side view in a 45 degrees. So let's go to about there. So if you do a straight cut, it creates a curvature. It's the curvature that I'm drawing here. Sort of, it's a parabola. A parabola. That's about the projection of a straight line onto a circle. Okay, so that's what I'm cutting. If all of this seems unnecessary effort to you, then um, in my experience, it's worth it. You invest a little bit of extra time at the beginning and you save a lot at the end for some shoddy result. And the worst case, the absolute worst case scenario is that you basically ruin the piece Who likes doing that? This knife is not strong enough. That we can see. All right. So now we have a pretty, pretty simple solution. Now, what I will also do is protect this so I can put it in the device. Actually, I'm just going to fold this. And I want 
balance is taped down quite well, actually. By the time you wrap a complete piece of paper, it's just a normal, regular piece of printing paper around a to be protected element. It's actually quite doing a lot of protection for your piece. So, I'm going to cut this. Yeah, look at that. Obviously what this does here, it just adds some weight to my item. So, I can hold it better. Almost yeah. doing this in a way so I might hopefully not do it much scratching to my piece uh, thing. Okay. Okay. So this is supposed to be laying on the flat. Obviously, uh, I am disregarding that this is oh, actually not going to do that. This is thinner, so let me get rid of that. Now I am actually off in the wrong, in the same, in the same wrong. Right. Let's have to remember that my line is not straight down. So let's go for it. Let's go for it. None of this is ideal. It's much better to have a proper table where your vice is probably fixed to, but we do not have this luxury at this very moment, so we're just going to persist. The issue, the biggest issue, you know what that is? 
that this table is so freaking smooth and I have to fight against it. So yeah, don't, don't copy that. Don't have any crap, crap laying around. That's of no help. What else can I take away? Should have about a quarter. Possibly, possibly, we're actually also looking at a little visit to Daiso. Daiso sells the cheapest and the best sewing blades. Making this noise. Huh? Is that weird or is that weird?
So, and then now, and that is eight, eight grams. And that is way more fantastic than drilling. Eight grams, that's twice as much as I've done so far. And uh, that's all I'm gonna do today. It's time for me to call it a day. I hope you enjoyed that. Huh, let me show you. Let me show you. Eight grand.